So we're, we've been working on walking socks away from the herd and down the road. And I've been doing sort of um, walk woe transitions with her. And she, when she's moving away from the barn and going down the road, she gets a little excited and she can overpass me or overtake me or try to go a little bit ahead. So the walk woe transitions are really good to try and get her to woe in spot. But what she does is she ends up trying to cross over and, and she probably wants to go back to the herd. So she wants to walk in front and, and make her way back to the barn. So I'm gonna work on that a little bit today and see if I can get some improvement in that behavior. So I'm just gonna walk back to the barn and then we're gonna do some walk woe transitions this way. So I did a little session with her earlier, and so this is very, very improved. I'm also wondering if the camera and the tripod are, are causing her to um, to be more behaving and more more better behaved. Um, we normally go to the end of the road, and I can I, I usually get a few where she tries to surpass me. And walk on. And go. Okay, let's go again. So now that they're gone, we'll see if we get
So this is much better. We did do some work with this, so that's improved a bit, but I, I do wonder if it's the camera and the tripod that's um, causing some better behavior. So I'm not going to keep doing this, it is good. I just wanted to show my approach to her surpassing me. It's basically using the whip to stop her and block her.